What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. Uh, last month, early last month, I uh, did a video where I gave a list of uh, different types of video of uh, different types of earbuds that range from um, the best noise canceling to the best uh, sound to my low key uh, earbuds uh, and you name it. Well, um, I try to hold off on this video because I knew I had um, some uh, at least. Uh, one more set of earbuds that I wanted to get in, wanted to run the gauntlet and see where they ended up uh, on the list. Uh, I wanted to get them in and get them uh, run through uh, against some of my best to see where they ended up before I did this video. And this video here is the top 10 uh, earbuds, in my opinion, of all the ones I own for 2022. These are some of them are not my favorites. Some of them may even be on my favorites list. There may be even some that are not even, uh, that weren't on the list that are on there now. Uh, so without further ado, let's get to it. Before we continue this video, I want to talk to you guys about uh, Beats for Hope. Uh, Beats for Hope is a 501c3 uh, nonprofit uh, volunteer based um, organization that helps with uh, putting, uh, giving food to the homeless in the uh, Alameda County uh, area. They help the Alameda County uh, Food uh, Bank and it helps out with all the uh, all the fam homeless families or uh, out there who need help in that assistance. And um, my man El Jefe is uh, one of the guys who works with them and they did make this design here for a church like this. Uh, this one is in honor of his wife who recently passed away. Uh, she was uh, very supportive of him uh, in this endeavor, and you can go out to uh, Beats for Hope's website. I'll leave a link in the in the uh, description below of this video, and you guys can go ahead and check out the merch. You can pick up shirts like this. They come in various colors. You can get hoodies and everything like that. Uh, it's a very uh, very worthwhile cause, uh, and it helps support um, a very worthwhile guy. He one of my he, he's one that got me up and going in this so uh he's a very good guy and this is a very good cause so i want you guys to at least go out and just take a look and if you like what you see go ahead and pick up a shirt hoodie uh whatever you see or you like out there all of it 100 percent of it goes to the alameda county food bank so they make sure that everyone out there uh at least get attempt to get everyone out there uh fed uh, which is very important, especially in these days and times. Okay. Again, that's beats for hope. Again, I'll leave the link in the description below. Please go ahead and take a look. Now back to the video. All right, All right we're back. Um, let us go ahead and, um, for starters, let's go ahead and give some honorable mentions out. I know, uh, there are some that may be on this list that are on the other ones. Um, but still want to give them shout outs. Uh, anyway, we'll start off with the uh, Sound Beats or the Beats Fit Pros. I uh, just got these in the, um, just added these to the collection recently. Um, they got great sound, even uh, in, with their app for Android devices. They uh, they don't have an equalizer setting on it uh, where you can adjust it, but they do got great sound uh, right out of the box. Um, just a, a great pair of hair buds. I just wanted to go ahead and give them uh, uh, honorable mentions there, along with the uh, sound, the Beat Studio Buzz also gives great sound. But again, uh, no EQ setting. Um, they do not have wireless charging, and they don't give uh, multi-point pairing and, and everything like that. So these are some of the reasons why they're getting um, honorable mentions because they they uh, didn't make the cut. All right, another one, another set that's getting an honorable mention, the Samsung Galaxy Buds 2 Pro. Great earbuds, especially if you're in the uh, Samsung ecosystem. I sort of am. I got the watch. I got the Tab S Pro, Tab S Ultra, rather. Um, but I'm not that, I'm not all the way in. <laughs> I used to be, but I'm not. Uh, again, a great set of earbuds. Uh, unfortunately, Samsung's taking the Apple route and having these guys where you can only get, you only get, uh, the full, uh, effect of, or 
um, gets the full range of features as if, if you're within the, uh, their, uh, ecosystem, which is a shame because these are really good earbuds. Um, all right. Another one that's getting honorable mentions, the biodynamic free birds, great earbuds. They do, um, only thing missing from these guys, that reason why they got cut out, uh, is they do not give you actual multi-point pairing. They give you multi, you can switch uh, quickly, but they don't give you that multi-point pairing where you're connected to the devices at once. Other than that, these guys are a great set of earbuds, great battery life, excellent sound, all right? And of course, uh, we got some, uh, just a couple other ones here I wanna give some honorable mentions to. Um, <clears throat> let me see where we at. All right. We got, of course, bang it, the, uh, not bang us in, but the Barrows and Wilkins PI sevens, uh, still a great set of earbuds, uh, no multi-point, um, uh, pairing on this, uh, and the battery life is the reason why, uh, it cut short. It's got an okay, uh, app, no EQ settings on it, of, of course, but. They do have that retransmission feature, which is excellent if you if you travel. Fantastic to have. Um, again, uh, just one thing that made them miss the uh, miss the cut. And just a couple more that I want to put out there on the limelight. Again, still not making the cut. The Bose Quiet Comfort Twos, the best noise canceling in the business. But that's it. I mean, they got good sound. They give you good audio. Again, that I think I I think that goes uh, hand in hand with the noise canceling. You get all the sound out of it because of the way it blocks out uh, all your ambient ambient noise. I still take these when I go to the store, Rockies around the grocery store. Um, only thing is, is they do not have multi point. They do not have mono mode. Only one you can use is the right earbud. Uh, and of course they took away the wireless charging. I said this before, say it again. Uh, and I always will say this until they at least fix, uh, the possibility of giving it a mono mode at the minimum and see if we can get multi-point, uh, on these, they, you know, we'll see, hopefully, uh, next year, early next year, those updates will come through. And of course, if they do, I'll cover it here again, great, uh, great sounding earbuds but just lacking the features. All right. And uh, one more. Let's go ahead and pull one more out here. My favorite to wear, the Sony WF-1000XM4s. Uh, they didn't make the cut because they don't give me multi-point pairing, um, but they do have everything else. Uh, the sound is good. ANC is second to none next to the Bose Quiet Comforts. App is probably the best. They probably have the best app uh, in the game. Um, but again, they didn't make the cut because they're missing out on that one feature. All right. Now, I have a couple other ones that was on the list. I got knocked off. Uh, well, but after doing some retesting, and I just want to give a quick shout out to the Soundcore Liberty 3 Pros and the Space A40s. Uh, after testing, they got knocked out of the lit off the list. Um, again, both of these are the only two on this honorable mentions that give me multi point and everything. They give me everything I want, but when I did the went sound for them, uh, they just got knocked off uh, out of you know based on that. I could have made these tied with my number ten, but I just left them off the list uh, since I already had one tied there that I couldn't bring myself to uh, break either way. So again, these are my honorable mentions. Let's continue. All right, let's get started. Uh, we're going to start with numbers 10 through six, starting off at number 10 will be the Sony link buzz S. These are really good earbuds, very lightweight, comfortable to wear all day long. Of course, they've got that same app as the XM4, so they got one of the probably the best app in the business. And uh, they now have that multi-point uh, feature, which puts them above, in my opinion. 
uh, puts them above the XM4s, at least right now, until the uh, XM4s get that feature as well. Uh, a great set of earbuds. They're coming in at number 10 on my list uh, right now. Coming in at number nine, these guys leapfrogged the, uh, excuse me, they leapfrogged the Link Buzz S. They were, this is their first time, actually this is the first time Link Buzz have been on the list, as well as these ones. And this is the One More <clears throat> Arrows, all right? Great sounding earbuds, has a spatial audio, gives you wireless uh, charging, multi-point pairing and connecting. Very good sounding earbuds, especially when I add my custom settings to them. These guys are fantastic. Uh, they come in at number nine on my overall list. All right, coming in at number eight on my overall list is, <clears throat> excuse me, the Liberty Fours. Now these guys were a little higher on my list uh, previously, but they've been bumped down after just going through some uh, uh, re-hearings after some earbuds got updates and everything, got some improvements. So I had to go ahead and I went through and I listened to all of these guys on my list one more time or three or four more times. I listened to them so many times with so many different songs uh, just to make sure I got the list that I wanted that I was happy with. Um, and these guys come in at number seven, or excuse me, oh yeah, number eight, excuse me, on my list. Very good set of earbuds. Again, these ones also have the uh in ear the heart monitor in the earbuds. So these are really, really good. And I, I do like that feature, especially for all you guys and girls out there that are heavy into fitness and everything like that. All right. So now we're at number seven. And number seven here, we have a tie. I could not get myself to to I couldn't give either one of them uh a leg up because they are basically right at the same point. Let me pull them out. First one will be the Google Pixel Buds Pro. All right, these guys are fantastic. They got that update, um, which improved them and gave them multi-point pairing and connecting. I'm st we're still waiting on the spatial audio update. They said that would be coming out. I don't know when. I, I don't even know if they put that on the back burner or not, but these are great sounding earbuds, especially if you're in the Google ecosystem with the phone and, the, and everything like that. Fantastic uh, sound, great bass. And now they have their own, they actually have their own graphic equalizer, made them even better, all right? And tied with them, I had to give it the one more Evos, all right? My Little Giants, I always call them my Little Giants because they're such a small package earbud. But these guys pack a wallop. Uh, fantastic um, sound, multi-point, you know, pairing and connectivity. You got like you, you it's just a great earbud. Um you got good battery life. Uh you got a uh, actually you got a really good app, one of the best uh feature rich apps as far as uh soothing sounds and everything else that you can go ahead and uh, adjust on these guys. Uh just a great, great set of earbuds here. You cannot go wrong at all. All right, coming in. I think we are now at number six on the list and that would be the techniques ATH or the AZ sixties <laughs> rather. I, I, I'm not even gonna do the e AZ sixties. I'm not even gonna go through the whole name, but these are excellent. These are one of the very first earbuds I've had that I owned outside of the Liberty three pros that had offered multi-point pairing and, and technician and tech connectivity. Listen to that. Where am I? Oh my goodness. All right. <laughs> the like again, a very good earbud. When I add my own uh EQ says to them, they sound phenomenal. Uh these guys, it, I call these basically the gatekeeper to the, my top five because you've got to be really good to get past these guys. All right. All right. So again, that's at number six. Now we're gonna jump into my my top five and this. Earbud, uh, this set of earbuds came in. I had them ranked lower earlier, but after a, they got a, a, I think they got an update and, you know, I gave me some feature updates uh, for them. 
and they and the and they went ahead and moved up my ladder a little bit. This sounds much better. They are the Bangin' Olsen Bo Play EX. These guys have now broken into my top five. Uh, they are living up to their potential now. I just want them to now improve the noise canceling on them. They got great bass. They got good uh, overall sound. Now focus on that active no noise canceling with these guys, in my opinion. And you've definitely got a top, uh, a top earbud here going in. Okay, very good sounding earbud. Uh, these are some of the ones that I got me into the stem style. Uh, but again, you got to that noise canceling needs to be improved in order for it to be better. But as of right now, there are my number five ranked earbud in my collection. At number four, we got a newcomer that came in, blew the doors off everything, do just about everything when he did the uh, gauntlet series, in my opinion. Uh, I mean, a lot of people aren't giving them their just due, but that's okay. I still think they're one of the best. And that is the Audio Technica ATH, uh, <laughs> ATH TW X9s. These guys are fantastic. Uh, I can't say I, I can't say enough about how Audio Technica has actually knocked it out the park with these earbuds right here. You've got no, you've got the noise canceling. You that which is good. You've got. Uh, multi-point pairing and connecting, wireless charging. You even have antibacterial sterilization in the case. So once you close it, the the action, they will actually start to sterilize the earbuds so you can pull them out and they'll be fresh uh, right out of, once you put them back in. As you can see, a very elegant with the matte black and I call it the dark bronze uh, look to them. Very small. Uh, stem style earbud, very, very great. I mean, just great sound. Uh, they definitely are worthy of a, at least a look. Um, and you know, for all you guys out there and girls out there who are not sure about these, at least give them a try, see what you think. I think they knocked it out the park with these ones. They have had other ones in the past that weren't as good, but I think. They really uh, nailed it with these guys here. They're coming in at number four on my overall list. All right, at number three, of course, you've got the Sennheiser Momentum 3s. Great sound, great noise canceling, excellent uh, bass, especially when I add my own personal settings to them. They are one of the best out there. Um, just a very, very good. Great, very, very good earbud. Definitely worth their price. Uh, again, a nice small package earbud here. Let me get that in focus a little bit. All right, there we go. Nicely packaged earbud. To be nice and discreet in the ear, but does pack a wallop. Definitely one of my best earbuds. As you can see, as you can see with the X9s, Sterilization in progress. I like that. All right. All right. Moving in at number two, the king has been dethroned. And they are the Bang It, bang, bang it All of Sin B.O. Play EXs. They have been dethroned to the number two spot. Still, this is a mountain that you definitely have to climb. This is elite level, uh, top tier um, area here. This is rarefied air, in my opinion between once you get to Sennheiser, the BO Play EQs, and my next set, this is Rarefy Air. You got you got really good noise canceling, great bass. I People complain, they say this, the uh, EQ sound low as far as audio. I had no problem with sound on these guys. Um, you know, I just wish they uh, give them uh, the wind noise reduction feature that they and, Included in the update with the um, EXs. I just hope they give it to these guys. I know these are a little older than the EXs, but still a great earbud and overall sound. Like I said, this is rarefied air when you start dealing with the Momentum 3s, these guys, and in, in my number one spot. 
This is very, very good set of earbuds. I enjoy these a lot, but they've been dethroned by my new number one, the Neuro True Pros. These are phenomenal. All right. You've got everything. You've got snap. You got the law. You got APTX lossless. You've got so you're future proof rather. So you you got all the other code like APTX adaptive APTX. You've got AAC SBC. Of course, you've got your personalized settings. Uh, when you go in, you immediately do a a, a sound test. They personalize your set. You personalize your sound, and you got three levels. You got three options you can choose from. You can choose the neutral level. Uh, the neutral side, if you don't want to, if you want to compare, you just want to use the neutral side for your personalized. And then you can do the pro EQ. They actually have a graphic equalizer on the app that if you don't want to use your personalized one, you can go to neutral and switch over to the EQ and use that way. And then of course you've got your personalized setting, which is specific to you. And uh, it, they just get better. You got the neutral, then you got your pro EQ, then you got the personalized. It just gets better. The sound gets better and better. On top of that, and of course, you've got active noise canceling and spatial audio. These guys are the total package. I just, I love listening to these guys. I put I put them up against the best, and they are about by far uh, the top of the food chain when it comes to uh, Airbuds here in my here in my collection. Um, just a great great set of Airbuds, and these guys totally reign supreme when it comes to uh, best overall earbud. So we will put these guys up here at the top of the mountain. So there you have it. My top 10 overall earbuds for 2022. Uh, again, some of them you might've seen in other listings, but this is just how good they are. And some, we got some newcomers that jumped in and came in with a, came in with a bang and are sticking in there and they stayed. So again, if, Thanks again for checking me out. If you like what you see, go ahead and hit the like button. Uh, if you want to join us on this journey, uh, go ahead and hit the subscribe button and hit the notification bell. That way you'll be notified uh, when these when all these uh, videos come out. Shout out to my notif uh, my notable mention earbuds. And, and then again, they, for some reason or another, they didn't make the cut, but they're still great earbuds. You might want to go ahead and uh, check those guys out. Um, of course I'll leave links to all my top 10 favorites here in the description. So you guys, if you're interested, you can go ahead and, uh, take a look and, uh, see if you like them. All right. Again, thanks for coming out and I'll check you on the next one. Peace.